In one way, it feels like it was only yesterday that I was standing in front of One Life supporters as we launched our Run Together campaign at the start of COVID-19. But in another way, that feels like a lifetime ago. We have learned so much during this time and we've walked through stuff that we would never had necessarily asked for or planned or predicted. But in that time, God has shown us so much. There's been incredible things like the online fundraiser. There's been moments of literally miraculous giving where people have felt they just wanted to back One Life and they felt prompted to do it before we launched any of our campaigns. We've had people telling us that they've been grabbing our resources and that young people have started to lead in the family for the first time. We've had youth pastors connecting with coaches saying that the coaching sessions they've had has dramatically impacted their relationship with the rest of the church leadership that they're working in. And we've had the privilege of uh, gathering together anything from 15 to 30 youth pastors every month to journey together through this crazy season. We've only recently just come out of the leadership week where every night we spent two hours together with about, I think it was 23 uh, young adults as we journeyed through material that would have been some of it at the school leadership, some of it fresh all around. How do we lead ourselves right now? from looking at our identity and leadership through to resilience and perseverance and how do we lead when we're not even in charge. The most beautiful moment though was when we got into small groups and we talked about what was standing out to us, what was a challenge for us and we prayed together. And I saw in those groups, because we'd gone on this journey, I saw the prophetic and the Holy Spirit speaking through Zoom in a way that I've never experienced before. There has been so many stories like this that accompany and are very real and sit next to the tough stories, the stories of struggle, the stories of stretch and of having to persevere. And it's not been easy as it's not been for any of us. But as we now turn to a new academic year, what are we looking at? We're even more committed to continue to track with youth pastors. So we'll be back in September with more coaching, with more online gatherings and with a brand new training resource for youth pastors to sign up for from January through to July so we can journey with them as they go through those months. We are more committed than ever to releasing our resources. Our vision is to digitalise the One Life sessions so that anyone, no matter what background, no matter what economic situation the church finds themselves in, anyone who wants to have access to leadership development to raise up their young people to lead can do it. So we want to give it away. We're applying for funding. We'll be fundraising for it. We want to see this as a project that we will deliver throughout this year that we can give away what God has given us and what we have been working on for the last 10 years. And for us as a team, we're going to begin to look at how do we continue to work um, as we start to move out of restrictions? How do we continue to run after the vision that Jesus has given us? But we want to say thank you. Thank you for walking with us during COVID-19 and thank you because we know you're walking with us as we all navigate this next season.